thing I've always liked about Belper is the, the way that like the train just go underneath the town. And I've always liked that. And I've always liked it. And, and I, I just, you know, especially now that Poundland's there. Like, so they just sort of like disappear under Poundland. And so for me, that's just beauty, you know. So, and, and you know, just a chance to put Poundland in a, in a poem. It's not something I'm really ever going to pass up on. So, um, I've not actually titled this one, but it's not going to have Belper in the title. I could just promise you that, because two people have done that already, so, you know, we're just going to gonna have to knock that on the head now. So, we'll, we'll just go for it. I don't know if it's very good, um, but also, you know, I only had a day to write it, a few couple of hours or something. Normally, some of my poems have taken me eight years to write. So, just, you know, just to get that one word that was not right, right. So, just to put that, you know, just to give you some context there as to why this isn't um, going to win any poetry awards, probably. So, we'll go for it. We'll just do it. The silent hum, murmured vibrations, clattering carriages, 80 miles per hour, 110 highest speed travelled, bridge 28. Boodlier, huddled like troops round the tunnel. Graph the earth beneath Poundland. My presence rumbles bricks, Midland mainline. Sheffield bound, green to red, red to green, never amber, apart from this valley. Grey stone on grey stone, accompaniment for copper tracks. Dry stone walls of mildewed moss. Alley barbers, bulbs of red, orange and, and green and yellow. Actually, that was meant to be in there somewhere. An old football, last kicked in the 80s. Temporary in its current destination. Floating in time to the scrape of metal. Fingernails hacking at a blackboard. A town tracked to the core. I fear for my reputation. Stood with a notebook and a pen. Looking down over the 2.30 to Penzance. A young couple smirk, uh, smirk as they walk past. I shake my head as if to imply that I'm definitely not a train spotter. <laughs> Thank you.